The 11 year old attacked by dogs in Columbia County says he had another surgery this morning. Next week will mark a full month now since Justin Gilstrap was attacked by dogs. News 12's Nick Veland has been following the story for us and joins us now live from a fundraiser in Justin's honor in downtown Harlem. And Nick, you say there's a new timeline on his recovery. So what does that mean? How's he doing? Yeah, well, Justin's mom, Erica, says that Justin has surgery today and on Monday. We know that he went for surgery this morning, and we're still waiting to hear about how that surgery went. But Justin's mom is hopeful that both these surgeries do go well so that doctors can start skin grafts soon. But all these supporters behind me are just rooting for Justin from afar. We're a small town, and we back our people. So, I mean... There's a lot of kids just from our school here right now, so <laughs> it's really overwhelming. Raven Truett's parents own Main Street Treats. She helps manage the store along with her sister. Both are teachers. Raven teaches at Uchi Creek where Justin goes. She has a personal tie to the family from teaching Justin's sister. It's a personal connection um, and being a part of our school, everybody wants to get back and do what they can do to help. Um, so this was just something that our family thought um, that we could do to help, um, maybe just in a little way. Raising money led hundreds to Main Street in Harlem to get a scoop of ice cream. Raven says a goal is bringing people to one place to talk about Justin. The people knowing Justin or having, you know, sharing stories, you know, how they know him or just seeing people coming from Evans and Augusta just, just to show their support because they can. Even though this event is close to a month after the attack, she says it shows the support isn't dying down. Just to see how far he's come, um, it, it's really just a praise that people have rallied around and you know that they'll continue to support him through his entire journey. And this event will go on until 8.30, and there's hoping to keep the momentum going until then for Justin. We'll keep you updated as to how surgery goes today and how he prepares for surgery on Monday. So good to see that turnout over there for such a great cause. Nick, thanks for the update.